As we begin a new hurricane season, our state is honoring more Harvey heroes, volunteer first responders getting recognition and an award and a thank you from the governor. Channel 2's Andy Sirota is live along Buffalo Bayou near downtown with that story. Andy. Keith, maybe you know someone who's a volunteer first responder. Maybe it's a relative, a friend, or even a neighbor. In addition to the brave men and women in uniform, they also played a very crucial role during Harvey. And today, some of them were recognized for their efforts. When Harvey rolled in, there was so much rain, too much rain. Neighborhoods and homes that had never flooded before were inundated with too much water. Countless people had to be rescued. Scores of them were saved by volunteers with the Southwest Community Emergency Response Team. To save somebody's life, and that's the most precious gift you can give somebody. Ray Field is their team leader. Today, on the first day of hurricane season, Field and his team members were honored for their commitment and dedication to the community. The governor issuing each member an outstanding volunteer award. We helped everybody we immediately got to. Um, we did it safe, we did it efficiently, um, and everybody was just so appreciative of what we've done for them. More than a dozen of these volunteer first responders came together during Harvey, pooling their resources, and as a result, saved some 800 lives. Just a group of everyday heroes not looking for recognition beyond deserving of it. You can call us heroes, but I don't think we're heroes. I think what we are are people who have got thicker skin to realize that there's no black, white, pink, or yellow, anything in the community. There's just one. And when you need help, we're here. The volunteers who were honored today are from all different backgrounds, and it's worth noting that part of their training consists of fast boater safety rules and basic first aid if needed. Live near downtown tonight, Andy Sirota, KPRC, Channel 2 News. All right.